Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna go ahead and pick some cards to see what's going on in this connection. How is your person feeling about you? What would they say to you? Where is this headed? And any other messages that we can get from the cards here. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick some cards from the Rider Wait Tarot deck to see exactly what is going on. How is your person currently feeling? For a lot of you, I'm seeing you're in no contact or like really minimal or sporadic contact. Um, okay, we got the High Priestess. So definitely you have been communicating in other realms okay like this person has not stopped thinking about you um they do definitely dream of you i feel like they have dreamt of you in like the last two days or two weeks or they will do that in the last in the next like two days to two weeks or maybe you'll even hear from them in the next two days to two weeks at the most two months okay i keep seeing the number two 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 twenty two that's the number of like balance so i feel like things are you know finally like balancing out for you or um like you're kind of how do i say how do I say this? Like the cosmic scales are balancing or you're kind of, you know, you've been working on yourself a lot and you've been learning how to balance your emotions a lot, regulate your nervous system. Uh, I know a lot of you are into manifestation. So I feel like if you are manifesting, this is a sign that there's a lot of movement going on behind the scenes right now. Okay. Your person definitely does have deep feelings for you. I am seeing your person, um, you know, thinks of you as someone who's like really mystical, magical, ethereal, like, you know, otherworldly. I don't think you realize like just how intriguing this person finds you okay like you're one of like the most interesting people they've ever met um and they just like they miss you a lot they miss your energy i do feel like you know this person is also trying to manifest you i think that's why i kept like channeling the number two like this is not just in your head like your person wants you as well yeah something to spell yeah okay we got the three of swords yeah okay so i am definitely seeing there's this fear of heartbreak or maybe you could have been left heartbroken or a little bit disappointed because of something that happened because of something that this person did um yeah but i am seeing that uh you know there is some like i feel like the both of you before you met each other you were kind of holding on to some kind of emotional baggage but it's like you decided to go on that date anyways you decided to meet up anyways but yeah let, let's go ahead and see like what else is going on with this three of swords i'm interested to see what the energy is yeah so i feel like with this nine of wands this person is interested in you and it's like you know they're kind of like i'm seeing like there's some kind of like stagnancy or like waiting game that this person is like playing it's like you know they want to come forward but they also want to like fully heal from this thing i feel like you know they have to open up their heart chakra a little bit more but this nine of wands is about like you know keeping tabs on you like not giving up on you like tenacity like i feel like this person is a little bit stuck Stubborn. Like they're not coming forward and making a move, but also at the same time, they don't want you to move on. And you're just like, what is going on? Like, why is this person like this? Why do they think like this? Yeah. Um, we also got the lovers. What the heck? Oh my gosh, this is the twin flame card. Okay. So I definitely feel like you are gonna reunite, okay? Twin flame reunion. Um, whatever you think you are, soulmates, twin flame, maybe you don't even believe in any of that. I am definitely seeing reunion is in the cards for you, okay? Um, I do see that this person has really deep feelings for you. They haven't stopped thinking about you. They do want this to go somewhere, okay? I am seeing they miss you a lot. I do feel like, you know, they're not seeing anyone else. They don't want to be with anyone anyone else okay they want to be with you and only you and i'm seeing like you know they're really connected to your energy now more than ever like you got you know two major iconic cards here um the high priestess the lovers there's definitely feelings here there's definitely you know attraction from both sides here like it's not just you feeling this way okay we also did get the three of cups yeah i am seeing okay there's a couple of different messages um you know pertaining to three of cups like yes one is you know third party situation but it doesn't always have to be that i am just seeing like you know maybe this person you know, first of all, this person finds you to be really fun and like really youthful and you have like this beautiful energy to you. You're really magnetic and captivating. But if there is a third party in this connection and I'm not telling something you already don't know, I don't feel like it's anything you have to worry about. I do feel like this third party is a karmic because we got the lovers. This is your tr true twin flame. I'm seeing maybe they have to be with the third party to realize just how much they want you and how much they miss you. I feel like, you know, they would dump anyone for you. Like they, they're going to come like running back to you. Yeah, we got the three of wands. I do feel like the third party could even just be like distance. Okay. I do feel like maybe this person lives like kind of far away from you. And, um, you know, that, that is something that kind of, has you know played or impacted this connection and this could just mean they haven't talked to you in a while or what i'm also seeing is that there could be a third party on your side they feel like there's someone else that you're really into or is into you because this person knows you're really attractive okay like seriously you have this amazing you know beautiful like energy to you and they're just like of course this person has options of course this person has like you know like suitors and like you know admirers and like yeah you, you probably do you know you do uh so this person sometimes does feel a little bit intimidated but i am seeing they are currently concocting a plan to come forward to come towards you okay like they're gonna miss you so much um or they're gonna be seeing signs of you that they'll have no choice but to reach out to you but i 
So I'm definitely seeing like this no contact situation is coming to an end. We got this Ace of Wands. Yeah, I'm seeing this person is really passionate about you. They do want to start something new with you. I am seeing a new beginning coming in for this connection for sure. Okay, like, like, they'll never lose that spark for you. Okay, they'll always carry that flame for you. They just think like, you're so intriguing, so amazing. And they're just extremely, extremely passionate about you. Trust. Um, I'm seeing fire sign energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Um, I'm seeing Cancer energy, Pisces energy, Gemini energy, okay? Uh, yeah, some more Pisces energy, the hangman. Yeah, I do feel like this person does feel a little bit stuck with where they are in life right now, and that, that could be something that's, like, preventing them from coming forward. They do feel like maybe... Um, you know, they just might not be like good enough for you right now. Or uh, I feel like this person has like ways of what do you call, um, you know, dealing with negative things that aren't very ideal. Let's just put it that way. Maybe this person could have like drinking tendencies or like addictions or just bad habits that they kind of need to like, you know, break through. Yeah. We got the eight of wands. So this person's definitely going to be contacting you. This person's definitely going to be coming forward. This person has been like dying to reach out to you. This person's been like itching to reach out to you. They're just like, oh my gosh, like I have to talk to this person. Yeah. Um, yeah. And again, they've been seeing a lot of signs about you, about this connection. They've been seeing like your name or seeing people that look like you, but they've been reminded of you a lot. Trust. Yeah. Um, we also got the queen of pentacles. Yeah. They see you as someone who's really ambitious, someone who has, um, you know, a, just a lot going on in their life. You're really interesting. You have a great personality. You have a lot of depth to you. You're someone that they can really talk to, hold a conversation with, okay? And this person is not ready to give up on you or this connection whatsoever. Yeah, we also got the Page of Swords. So this person has been heavily stalking you, like heavily stalking your social media. This person has been keeping tabs on you, okay? And they think about you a lot. They literally cannot stop thinking about you. Um, yeah, we also got the Two of Cups. Wow, we got the Soulmate card. We got the Twin Flame and Soulmate card. So again, I feel like whatever is happening is happening for you and this person to get back together. So don't be fooled by the 3D reality. I know sometimes the 3D can seem a little bit um, demoralizing or discouraging, but you have to realize that everything that's happening is bringing them back to you, okay? That's the mentality that you have to live by. But I am definitely seeing a lot of positive things and abundance coming your way regarding this connection. This person does have feelings for you, okay? Um, I'm seeing like mutual feelings, like they are reciprocating your feelings too. They literally cannot stop thinking about you. Whatever you're feeling, they're feeling back, okay? They, like they're into you just as much as you're into them, okay? So yeah, I, I feel like this is unfolding for you um, in the best way possible. There's a lot that you can't see, you know, that's happening behind the scenes, but I do see this person definitely making a move towards you. We've got the Page of Swords, that's like the messenger. Um, you know, pages are the messengers of the deck. And, you know, this person's been thinking about you heavily, stalking you a lot. Eight of Wands. Yeah, this person for sure is going to be contacting you. Yeah, let's go and pick some Love Oracle cards to see what other messages we have here. We got, even though we are so different, I feel so connected to you. Yeah, you guys, this person never stopped feeling the connection, okay? It doesn't even matter how far apart you are in the world or what's going on. This person, like, stays thinking about you. Um, we also got, I have so much passion for you and desire for you drives me mad. Ace of Wands. Yeah, this person's extremely passionate about you. Uh, we also got, when you touch me, I feel butterflies in my stomach. Yeah, like, this person is just, like, so enamored by you, taken aback by you. We also got, thank you for teaching me what real love is. I do feel like, you know, this person... Um, like they didn't know what real love was until they met you. Like they felt like everything else was just like, you know, practice. And like this is like the real thing. So I feel like you're the only person that this person has like felt these deeper feelings for. Um, and it's like they, I feel like they tried kind of running away from this connection just because they were so scared of heartbreak because we did get the three of swords energy here. Um, so they could have gone to something easier or like, you know, just um, kind of found ways to like, you know, distract themselves from this. But it's like, no matter who they're with, no matter what they're doing, they stay thinking about you. Like, they literally can't stop thinking about you. They do feel like you're um, a really important, like, person in their life. And even if this was really short-lived, I am definitely seeing um, there's more to come, okay? I feel like you barely just, like, you know, touch the surface of this connection and there's, like, more abundance coming your way. And we, we literally got the Two of Cups and the Twin Flame card, you guys. Like, this person has deep feelings for you and you're you're not crazy to feel the way that you do. You're valid in feeling the way that you do because, like, again, this person has been sending you like messages telepathically you are energetically connected i feel like that will materialize in the 3d but anyways i will end the reading right here i really really hope this helps i do want to let you know that i offer in-depth tarot readings as well as manifestation coaching and also custom makes subliminal so if you're interested in any of these services check out the description box below where you can sign up for them and yeah i will end the reading right here thank you so much love and light